Welcome back, True Seeker. July 25th, 2018. Big space news today. The Italian Space Agency says they have confirmed there is water under the surface on the planet Mars. And before we get into this, I want to let you know my book released earlier this year, Letters and Numbers. There's a chapter in this book on the history of space news and how all space news is contrived by a code, a code which is important to Freemasonry, especially the Scottish Rite of Freemasonry, which is in control of NASA and other space programs throughout the world. And as I state in the book, if you learn this code, you can see why space news releases the day it does across the world, from NASA to India to the Italian Space Agency to things such as Elon Musk and Bezos, you know, their SpaceX and their, what's uh, the Bezos one, Blue something, whatever. All of the news for these programs is contrived by a very repetitive code that is important to the Scottish Rite of Freemasonry. And I just want you to notice that Italian Space Agency, who put out this news today, has the same gematria as Scottish Rite using the alphabetic order, the most simple cipher there is. Today, the day of this news, July 25th, it's also the day leaving 159 days left in the year and notice Scottish Rite is also 159. This is why my book is so important. Nobody could read this book and disprove a word of it for any disbeliever or person on the fence if they read this book and then pay attention to what happens every single day in the news. It's like, okay, I guess this guy had it cracked. And that's exactly what I've done. I've cracked the code for how reporting through the media is done from space and beyond. We live in a world of nonstop propaganda, contrived information, and it's all meant to keep us in a bubble, you know? The people who do this, they're interested in controlling us, our behavior, our beliefs, period. That's what this is about. So anyway, coming back to this, Scottish Rite News. Notice Scottish Rite has the Gematria 57, also like Mars in the base ciphers. Outer Space is 57, Conspiracy 57, Moon 57, and a whole lot more. Read the book. So, today, Scottish Rite ritual releasing this news. Notice the thing that um, supposedly has discovered that there's water beneath the surface. It's abbreviated Marsis. And... I just had to check the abbreviation, and of course, Marsis sums to 47. If you're new here, I've been saying we need to start a campaign. What is 47? This number is trademarked all over in so many things because it's so important to Freemasonry. Their logo, the capital G with the compass above it. The compass is set at 47 degrees. It's a tribute to the 47th problem of Euclid about how to establish foundation. The word foundation in Gematria sums to 47. It's also a tribute to the tropics, which measure the solstices, which measure time. The tropics of this earth, the tropic of Capricorn and Cancer, they're 47 degrees apart. The word time with the alphabetic order, 47. This is why everything is released information-wise, ritualistically, by a code, in accordance with the dates of time. Always. Period. So, Marsis 47, of course. And this thing stands for Mars Advanced Radar for Subsurface and Ionosphere Sounding Instrument. That's what the full title is. And what's interesting is with the alphabetic order, that sums to 947, which is the 161st prime number, and today's news is about how this instrument can detect beneath the surface for Mars that there's water beneath the surface, 161, 947, the 161st prime. And these prime number relationships paramount in this study. 
It's also referred to as the Mars Advanced Radar, which has Gematria of 147, like outer space, like Freemason, like conspiracy. And again, if you read my book, Letters and Numbers, I need to update that. It's not coming soon anymore. It's been out since March. If you read my book, the chapter about the history of space, this is a number we talk a whole lot about, 147. Very important number as well. So, you know, here's another prime example of how important this code is. Another pr proof that backs up what I've been asserting for over five years now, what I've been teaching about, what I've written a book about. All the people who leave comments that, you know, I've been following you for a while and I'm on the fence. I, I don't know what you're on the fence for. Uh, could you guys, when you leave these comments, could you tell me why you're on the fence? I, I'm, I'm confused what fence there is to be on. You know, every single day, I prove my points a million times over. You know? Well, how, how can you possibly be on the fence? How, how can I possibly have critics? I, I don't understand, you know? You guys want to live in that bubble they've created for you. That's the problem. You know? You want to be controlled and ruled over and lied to. That's the problem. That's why you're on the fence. That's why you criticize my work. You like this world of lies and convenience. That's the thing that you really like, the convenience. You know, it's easier to not have to think about things and what's really being done. But what you should think about, because this is true of almost all of you who are adults, you go out and work and you slave every day, and a big chunk of your paycheck goes to the government, and it pays for this propaganda and these lies. You know? A lot of you could work four less months a year You know, if you didn't have to pay the government your wages. Imagine if you had four extra months off of free time a year to enjoy. You know, with yourself, your friends, your family. That's the reality. That's how much of the year you work that goes to the government. You know? The point of me doing this research isn't just to line up numbers every day. It's to get people to see what's going on. Which has been very clear to me since long before I knew this code that we're lied to, that we're terrorized, and all by this same organization. You know? We're stolen from. We're purposefully dumbed down. All by this same game. You know? We're all taught to be a bunch of believers, not to question authority, to do as we're told. Saw through it all as a child, honestly. You know, 20 years before I knew anything about this code. But once I figured out this code, started doing the research, wasn't too hard to see what was going on. You know? And if you doubt the Scottish Rite controls space, just do a little research. It's not even a secret. Yeah, the Scottish Rite of Freemasonry is a secret society, but it's not a secret that they control the space programs. They put that out for people to know. This story in the middle, I'll do my next video on this one. It's hilarious. Until next time.